Hi, I'm Doug Lay with Pepperdine University and, and I'm loaned to the National Science Foundation uh, temporarily right now. Uh, I'd like to share with you some uh, learning nuggets that uh, came across from the Sakai 2011 conference um, during a discussion, a general discussion of uh, the Sakai op open academic environment. Uh, some new features uh, of Sakai were introduced, including some uh, features related to uh, file sharing, known as publishing, uh, as well as uh, social network functions of Sakai that are coming about. And perhaps more importantly than the actual technologies or implementations themselves, were the reconsiderations of the ways that these can enhance the student learning experience and really uh, open up a longer and more encompassing dialogue regarding uh, intellectual pursuits. With regard to the social networking function, what was interesting is that as opposed to most social networking sites like LinkedIn or Facebook or any number of other uh, sites that people use for mm, entertainment purposes, uh, the features built into Sakai allow for people to create their own social networks in the sense of creating their own groups for collaborative purposes, which I think really changes the way that people might consider how social media and social networks um, have a possibility within education. Um, that is to say, rather than just being something that's used for the sake of um, uh, communicating and staying in touch with people, a way of actually collaborating on documents and creating life cycles uh, for that kind of work. Uh, with regard to the notion of publishing um, uh, documentation, the way that it was shared uh, within the uh, open presentation was that uh, much like SSRN, uh, if you're familiar with that, is a network for, for sharing early drafts of documentation. In the same way, Sakai will be able to support the ability for people to share uh, early or final versions of their uh, intellectual uh, contributions, reports, videos, images, uh, and those can of course be matched up together into a single document. Uh, to be able to share those so that others may be able to comment on them be able to learn from them, be able to establish social networks around uh, common interests or common tags or common keywords that are associated with those, which I think really opens up new opportunities for uh, interdisciplinary collaboration that might not exist uh, in many existing infrastructures right now.